Hello everyone and welcome to the first instalment of a new Sims 4 series. This is... Tom and Rose's Crazy Neighbourhood. Now as you see, young Tom is in bed. Yes, the family name here is Tank Engine. And Gordon is in the parents' bedroom. And Bluebell is in the bath. Um, right now, they have no way of paying their bills. <laughs> we knew. <laughs> Whoa! As a matter of fact. <laughs> Ends in Gordon's new. got work in six hours. <laughs> and Bluebell's got work. We knew <laughs> in two days. <laughs> Rump. Rump. So she has a task to do. She needs to read books. Does she have any in her inventory? No, she doesn't. So the one thing I forgot to put around their house was a bookshelf. So, <laughs> if I can just do that quickly, provided I've got enough simoleons to be able to afford it. There you go. So, it's looking as though Even though it seems pretty arbitrary to me, then she should need to get to know her own husband. But ridiculous. Yep, you need something to eat, don't you, Gordon? Well, guess what? You're going to cook yourself something. Or maybe not. Uh, uh, oh. <laughs> oh, Niara. <laughs> Oh, kiss of hay. Hmm. That's good. Hmm. 
but the teenager or the boy, the the kid, yeah, he still has fifty days before becoming a teenager. Still plenty of time. Anyway, people. We are now going to play as the Marsh family for a bit. in this very oddly haphazardly built house so I'm playing as young Rose uh, wherever she may be uh, well that's her right there so mm -hmm. And for whatever reason, I'm going to have a traveling with her dad. Two. Visit. <laughs> okay. Let's see if we can get them making friends. Together. The entire two families. Well, in that case, I should have had her travelling with both her parents. Whoops. Okay, both Rose and Thomas need to go to school soon. So we have picked the wrong day to bring them out traveling. Or the wrong time. Even though kids can go to school from each other's houses. And so we'll send Terry home too. Hmm. Terence, Terry, whatever his name is. Okay. Ah. <laughs> Floopy.
Okay. And this is just because... And the parents need to claim their bed, which they already have. Well, we don't have enough space for two kids in the house. Okay. Raz people for show. Huh. Short story time. And what we're going to do is we're going to save that. Yeah, how about it? Although a ball Weasley doesn't look like a good idea. What, they've got no furniture? 
How's that possible? No furniture. I thought I put them in there to live furnished. And now they have to work in normal jobs, which... <laughs> I know they won't mind. I've already done that. Right. We need to start furnishing their house. Now that is going to be easy. Both Fred and George will go into the entertainment business. Already has a job. Right. Not going to make him a criminal, obviously. Um. Make him an entertainer. Quas not. And Paul Jenny. I think I need to edit her so she has her hair back. Does she have a job? No, she doesn't. And Michael Myers has come to welcome them already. <laughs> Ooh, I'll make her an athlete. 
Because after all, That is what she originally How did she end up with no hair though? Does she have chemotherapy? <laughs> Right. I'm going to stop this one here. Because look, they don't have anything in their house and I'm going to have to do this floor by floor. Yeah, no bore.